5G has reached a level of public debate that is unprecedented for mobile technology. It seems that no public institution, no company, no enterprise, no industry can survive without having a 5G strategy. Clearly, it's a part of a digital infrastructure. Digital infrastructure is necessary for companies who want to digitize their business. We're talking about factory automation, predictive maintenance, AI, machine learning, augmented reality, robots, logistics, many, many digital use cases, and we've collected a vast bunch of them. Eventually, all of them require a digital infrastructure, and 5G takes a key role, mainly in the form of mobile private networks. A mobile private network is a cellular network that lives in the context of a particular factory or a particular plant. It provides better coverage, greater reliability, greater mobility and security than any other networking technology that can be deployed inside an industrial production environment. And therefore 5G will take a key role. Now, why is that the case? We think 5G, especially a mobile private uh, 5G network, makes the company's network. It's theirs. They can control it, they can configure it, they will manage it, they'll make sure it performs exactly to the levels that is required by their digital use cases. We believe that you should start with use cases that do not require any retrofitting. You should not start with use cases that require any process change. Start with the simple ones. They will give you huge benefits already, but conceive of the roadmap of use cases that you have in front of you, because designing such a mobile private network, you have to look across uh, the various use cases that you're going to digitize. And doing so will lead you to either simple or complex networks. Simple networks being a bit cheaper in the 50 to 100,000 US dollar total cost of ownership, while the complex ones are a bit more expensive, but they also support more advanced features and functionality.